It's believed the first settlers brought the pathogen in the soil and plant material of rootstocks to establish the first orchards in WA. Jarrah timber was a major commercial timber for Western Australia, so the death of these trees was a major economic concern. The disease was named Jarrah dieback. In 1959, the disease had been recognised at 33 locations, or approximately 0.2% of the Jarrah forest. It was only in 1965 that Frank Podger, with the assistance of George Zetmeyer, described the cause of this Jarrah forest collapse as Phytophthora cinnamomai. The identification resulted in significant increased understanding of the biology of the plant disease and by the 1970s, hygiene and quarantine protocols were being applied during mining and forestry activities within the Jarrah Forest. The first recognition of Phytophthora dieback in the Jarrah Forest and the naming of the disease as Jarrah dieback has resulted in a number of major misconceptions. Many people believe Jarrah is the only susceptible species and the disease is only in the Jarrah Forest. However, Jarrah is only one of more than 2,200 native plants affected in Western Australia. <laughs>